Hey everyone, it's Monica with Kids Kids. Fortunately, I'm here by myself tonight because we were really busy today and I forgot to record a video. So it's uh, 9 11, Raina's in bed, Kevin's at work, and I'm recording for you guys. So, happy Sunday, everyone. And today I'm doing a little bit of a different um, perspective on my creating. I also sew. Um, clothing, hats, aprons, you name it. But I haven't done it in a long time. And I've decided that I'm going to get back into it. Because it's fun. So, um, we were over at the new Leslieville Farmer's Market today. Didn't really find anything because it was just, um, first day open today. And they had a lot of vendors. I was really impressed. Um, but anyway on our way back. We were looking for fr fruits and vegetables, that's why we didn't get anything and there wasn't any there yet today. So um, on our way back we stopped at a yard sale and I bought fabric. Actually Raina had to go back and get the fabric because the lady didn't have change so we had to come home and then we ended up getting some more stuff. So Kevin got this extremely cool um, antique mm, briefcase kind of suitcase thing which I'm definitely going to use for my shows to like display baked goods or something just because it's so cute and it's really neat because when you open it each side zippers and then you close it so you can have like you know the neat folded clothes without them um, wrecking I guess or unfolding whatever the case may be wrinkling there you go um, so yeah so we've had an awesome weekend and um, I will show you what I got today at the yard sale so okay I have, for, by the way, all together, all we spent was $35. Marina got a suitcase for Kevin, three um, floor rugs, um, you know, like typical um, rag rugs, so they're about maybe three feet or so by two feet, and nice colors, by the way. So I got white waffle material, this really cool kind of, um, I don't know what kind of material. I told her I like cotton, so this kind of looks like a muslin type thing. Okay, I got, oh, she gave me a hat, too, by the way, but it's a little bit too small for me. So, um, isn't that gorgeous? She is a designer herself. So her name is, let her, let's give her a shout out, Janet Katarina. Ah, that's so cool. Another designer in my own neighborhood. Okay, so I got this gorgeous material. I cannot wait to make something with this. It's so soft. So thinking I'm going to make Marina a beautiful dress in that for the summer. And um, or maybe a shorts because we were going to go today and get her some shorts. So maybe I'll have to make her some shorts. And I got this. Whoop. <laughs> Rose pattern fabric. I'm not sure what I'm going to make with that but Marina said a dress. So there you go. Maybe I'll make her a beautiful summer dress. And I got some ducks. Oops. I'm oh, sorry. Some duck ones. This I think will be nice for aprons, I think. Because, you know, whatever. Cotton. And I got lining for to put inside of this. Ah! One of my favorite materials ever to work with and have on seersucker. For those of you who have um, ever had the pleasure of wearing this, my grandmother talked highly of this stuff. It's so comfortable. It almost feels like you're walking around naked <laughs> in the buff. So yeah, I can't wait to make something for this with this. Sorry. So I'm going to um, set up my sewing machine this week and hopefully show you guys some things that I've made. I'm going to have to look and see if I have some of my old hats because. I used to make the cutest little summer hats, bucket hats basically. Um, they weren't really cloches because they had like a flat top. But yeah, so um, other than that, I didn't crochet today because I just didn't feel like it. <laughs> and I got another boo boo now on this finger. My blood vessel kind of popped. We were making um, homemade pancakes today. And I felt it kind of going when I was using the first stirring spoon and then when I changed to the whisk just one way that I hit it and it put searing pain through my finger so 
it's not too purple and blue because I grabbed an ice water bottle right away thanks to Marina saying it. Um, this is first aid, by the way. So, yeah, that's my creativity for today. Or my way to creativity because it's going to be, you know, showing you in a couple of days. So that's it. Happy crocheting, everybody, and happy crafting, and happy everything else that you use your brain with. Creative side of your brain. And I love you all. Bye.